Halloween, of course, is tomorrow, and this morning, medical experts are urging parents to talk to your little trick-or-treaters about distracted drivers. ABC Action News reporter Lauren Rosella is driving Tampa Bay forward now with some safety tips that you can share with your kids before they hit the streets tomorrow night. Traffic safety experts say to talk to your kids about walking on the sidewalk if there is one available. If there is no sidewalk, walk facing traffic as far to the side as you can. This way you can move quickly out of the road if you feel threatened by traffic. Remember, drivers don't expect to see trick-or-treaters in the roadway or to come out from between parked cars or behind shrubbery. And experts with BayCare Health say to make yourself as visible to drivers as possible, especially at night and in low light. A nice reflective bracelet, maybe some type of little blinky light that they can wear so that vehicle drivers can see them. It does get darker earlier. Also, if for your bags that you want to get candy, something that's reflective just so that people can see you. All this comes as it's been nearly a year since an F-150 truck hit six-year-old Dominic Keys while he was trick-or-treating in Trinity with his brother. He was in a marked crosswalk. Dominic survived but has spent the year recovering. The National Highway and Traffic Safety Administration also recommends carrying a flashlight and holding it on the side closest to traffic. In Tampa, I'm Lauren Rosella, ABC Action News.